Good morning, everybody, and welcome to Glitchy Skies, episode four. In the last episode, we built this monstrosity that I still have no idea how exactly it works. Uh, I just know that it does. Yeah, hey, whatever. I, I, I don't get it. It's just physics and shit that I don't understand. I also used all my water. We also built a... Uh, spawning platform in an attempt to get some mobs to spawn up high and then fall down and kill themselves. Well, I continued with that idea, with the general idea of trying to create it. Just, you know, testing. I didn't really expect anything to come of it until I built that thing. So the general idea was that I'd build a lower platform and then I decided to enclose it a bit to get it to spawn mobs during the day. It was the idea anyways. And the thought was that enough mobs would spawn and start shoving others off. Boop. Well, I don't think it's working right now because it's too bright out. Boop. We can find out real quick. Yeah, okay, so nothing's up here right now, but if I hit F7, boop, we can see that mobs can spawn here all day, every day, but mobs can't spawn here all day, every day. Which, yeah, okay. Um, so that's why it's enclosed like this. So the idea is that they keep spawning here, they wander off in this direction, this is obviously closed, and then they get pushed off and fall down there. It's the idea anyways. Whee! And for a while, it was actually working. Hey, I should probably check something just to make absolutely sure. Whee! Escape. Options. Difficulty. There we go. Okay. Done. Back to game. All right. This is uh, the first time I've opened this on this computer. I have fixed my slight computer problem. Um, remember what I was saying? I needed a new motherboard and such. And, you know, we were, I was having massive, massive hard drive issues. And it pointed to the idea that my hard drive controller was dying. Well, I kind of figured out what was going on. Um, I was looking at motherboards as a replacement for, you know, well, a replacement motherboard. And I was thinking I want one that, uh, can be upgraded. Something that uh, we will, you know, will fit where it needs to be now. So I could use my, or use the current hardware that I have for the uh, new motherboard. Yeah, okay, let, let, hang on. Let me get my thoughts straight. I could use the processor, RAM, and video card that I already have in my new motherboard. That way I don't have to worry about, you know, compatibility issues, but have room to upgrade. That was the general idea anyways. Well, I looked into motherboards and they are not cheap. And by they are not cheap, I mean the motherboard I was looking at was, or they started at $200. And those were the ones that were just to replace my motherboard. They weren't even to uh, upgrade. They were just to replace my motherboard. And I'm like, okay, that's a bit nuts. That's a bit too much. You know, what are my other options? And then I thought about it for a couple of seconds. I went, you know what my other option is? and I installed Windows 8 on my PC. And all of a sudden, all of my hard, hard drive problems went away. I don't have hard drive problems anymore. <laughs> don't ask me how that works, but it totally works. Now, you might be asking what I'm doing here. I am building an environment to grow plants. I'm finally building my garden. It occurred to me yesterday 
yeah, that I have survived probably for, I don't know, a month, maybe longer, on nothing but apples. Let's make this a little bit smaller. <laughs> and I know apples are considered relatively healthy, but surviving on nothing but apples for that long cannot be healthy. Just can't. So I am going to fix that situation because, I mean, if I had even just potatoes, yeah, potatoes, it would be better. So I figured I'd do something about that. You know, get some potatoes because I can. Put a torch there, there. I'll get another torch for there later. Uh, so what is the idea? Ooh, what is the idea? How do I, how do I plan on doing this? Because I just realized I wanted this all sunken in, but I don't know how I'm going to get uh, underneath all of this to get the water where it needs to be. Because the water needs to be on things. Well, okay, it doesn't need to be on things. Hmm. Boop. I wonder if that'll work. Boop. Boop. Yeah, that'll work. Boop. And then... Put my wood planks back. I don't think they're wood planks. They're slabs, aren't they? Yeah, oak wood slabs, oak wood plants. Yeah, these are all made out of slabs. All right. Um, so, yeah, I want food. I have stuff to grow. So I want to give it a try. I want to I want to start kicking this into high gear and to do that I'm going to need proper amounts of food. So that's what I'm doing here. So space for um water, space for dirt. Eee. Do this nice and slow so I don't fall to my death. Eee. And yes, I'll be putting torches up because I really don't want to be dealing with mobs in unexpected places. It's already bad enough that I have the mob spawner up there. See, it actually works. And he's got string. How do you get string? I'm going to very much run out of dirt, aren't I? One, two, three, four, five... And then I need what? One, two, three, four, five, six left. There are six more. All right, let's take a look at what we can do. Um, don't want to kill off all of my saplings. Actually, you know what? I want to keep two of each. Should be able to restart from scratch. One. Two. Three. Four, five, six. All right. Bat. Yeah, that's another thing that happened a lot since those guys moved in. Is that bats are have been flying around a lot. All right. So where is my bucket? Bucket, bucket, bucket. Where is my bucket? There's my bucket. Okay. As you can tell, I've actually gotten some stuff from the them falling and dying it's not quite high enough I probably should have taken the opportunity while it was still in peaceful to uh, tear it down and rebuild it from scratch with the idea that uh, it needs to be a little bit higher to kill things because well I mean I think it's high enough to kill anything that's not armored or not special in some way. Like, the angry zombies would be a problem. But I think angry zombies only spawn from the nodes. I think that's why we saw that one node down there spawning zombies. Um, boop. 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 Alright, there we go. Now we got water. I need a hoe. Are we dirt yet? Dirt. How about you guys? Dirt, 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 dirt. All right. 
Now those can refill with uh, water next time it rains. Three, four, five, six. All right, good. I did count right. All righty. Now we have a garden. And hopefully, uh, if this all works out like it should, I should be able to uh, make more dirt than I can before because all I have are trees and saplings. But once I, once the garden goes, ooh, hey, it's raining. These barrels can fill up. Yay. I love how this all works. Hmm. Anyways, um, I could use the stuff grown in the garden, the extra stuff grown in the garden to fill up the oak barrels to make, you know, stuff. Um, I need a hoe. So I need to be able to actually keep track of what the hell I'm doing. There's an Enderman. Okie dokie. Enderman going apeshit. Now, if I remember correctly, water actually extends out four blocks. That's why I was actually making it out here initially, but I stopped when I realized it was going to cut into the uh, stairs here. So, Ooh, I could take that thing down, and then I'll make my house over here. Yeah, that'll work. All right, so I have seeds. I have lots and lots of seeds. We have just regular seeds for wheat, pumpkin seeds, which I don't think I'm going to use, melon seeds, which I'm not going to use yet, uh, tree, tree, carrot, grass, which I'm going to use later, acorn, potato, rubber, sugar cane, which I'm going to use later. That's all I got. That's all I got. All right, so we will start with the wheat, because that'll be useful. And I'll just do a uh, simple nine or three by three. How much space do I have? One, two, three, one, two, three, and then one, two. All right, so I will do pretty much the same thing for the carrots and the potatoes. And just designate this is going to be potatoes, this is going to be carrots, and then I don't know yet. Depending on what other seeds I get. Speaking of, let's put this stuff away all of this stuff away. Put away my wood so everything's nice and organized. I can find shit later. Give me some quick food. And I did a little bit of, well, cobblestoning. And uh, I did manage to get a significant amount of gravel, sand, and dust. Now, I know these things have uses, significant uses, outside of uh, sifting. But I'm going to sift them because they're just insanely useful. Let's see, I have plenty of space. That zombie's still there. He doesn't have a helmet on, so when it's sunny and it stops raining, he should die. Hmm. All right, so gravel. Let's put some gravel through here. I think, I think, I think, I think gravel gives me uh, flint, which would be cool if it did because, well, I can fix my tools. Yep, there it is. There's flint. And coal. Nice. Ooh, and a diamond. Awesome. Two more. Give me two more diamonds. I want two more diamonds. And some iron. Lots of iron. Though I don't think iron's going to be a problem. I wood. I have cobblestone, and I need redstone. I should be able to get those things. Because I can do crazy, crazy, crazy shit if I can get three diamonds. What do we got so far? Boop, boop. All right, we have lapis. That's nice. Aluminum, tin, iron. So we have enough for one ingot of iron. Diamond, coal, and flint. Sag mill grinding ball. Oh, 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 I see, I see, I see. All right. Uh, let's do some sand. 
Because I do know I need redstone, though I think redstone is dust. Let's see. That thing. Certus Quartz. That's it. Uh, shocking! Oh, it's a charged Certus Quartz. Uh, let's see. Crushed iron ore. That's cool. I need plenty of iron. You are aluminum. Lead. The hell are you? Tin. Okay. They all look the same. Oh, wow. I'm getting, like, everything. Uh, ancient spores. I'm not sure what that is. I think that's a tree, but I can't use it right now. Tin, nickel, osmium. I basically have to do this a lot. And I'll probably do most of this off camera. I just want to do the initial stuff. Ooh, cocoa beans. Nice. Alright. Anything else? No, nothing else interesting. So let's put those up in here. Do some dust. Like I said, I need redstone. So redstone would be really, really nice right about now. Bone meal. That's mildly useful. Some dust ore. Uh, more dust ore. Bone meal. Ooh. Blaze powder. Ooh, yes, redstone. Okay, so we got one redstone. Uh, let's see, what else do I need? What else do I need? I need seven iron ingots. And two more diamonds. Iron should be relatively easy to get our hands on. Boop. All right. So redstone, silver, uh, iron, copper. All right. So I need lots of iron. Bone meal. Let's put the bone meal in here. Seeds in there. Uh, I have nothing else organic on me. Really important shit there. Really important shit there. This I have plans for, and that's just useful for fixing my tools. Can you make me a nice sword? Ooh, I could probably make a flint sword, can't I? Ooh, that would work. That would be nice. Uh, boop, 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 boop. So let us make some chests. And I'll put them over top of the furnaces here. Boop. Boop. Okay. Put the torch back. And then we'll put the, uh, that stuff in here. The stuff that ends up as, boop, uh, cooked ingots. What all do I have? I have enough for one iron right now. Yep, gotta keep working on that. Let's go kill this guy. I don't have to worry about other things falling down on my head, but... Zombie flesh. Hey guys, you wanna fall down any? No? Hmm. Another thing I need to make are fans. So, uh, I think I brought that up before. Fan. Where are you? Did I bring that up before? One out of one. Fan, 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 fan. Where, oh, where, oh, where are you? It's always hard to find things in any eye. And I don't remember what mod pack it was from. Ah, there it is. Open blocks, the fan. Which needs... Uh, seven iron and some, co like, a uh, cobblestone slab. Boop. And I would need a bunch of them for up there. And the idea for that would be that things could spawn there and the fans would push them off. It's the idea, anyways. I would hope that would work. Whee. 
Can you make me some more torches? 16. And... 16 of those. Boop. Alright, so plenty of torches now. Nice. Boop. Alright, worry about making that look pretty later. Alright, so what is the next thing in line that I need to do? Hmm. I'm not 100% sure. I think primarily I need iron. And I mean, I seriously need iron. So, I think I'm pretty much stuck sifting things. Hmm. Alright, and let's see, I've been recording for about a half an hour, so yeah. I don't feel like I've done much in this episode. I mean, we made a garden, uh, we're getting sifting stuff, we're doing all of this, we've got plans for things. I've shown that I am still mildly incompetent in building mob spawners. Just wait until I can get... Um, uh, uh, crap, what is that thing called? A uh, grinder, yeah. Wait until I can get a cr grinder, then I'll, uh, I'll make a great mob spawner. And then we'll have, like, everything, and we won't have to worry about anything. But, of course, I have to get all the stuff to do that, and to do that, I need to sit here and, you know, right-click a shit ton. So, I will end the episode here, and I will say to you guys, as always... Keep playing the game, and have fun.